it's Tessa and I'm here with another Watch It Wednesday for Waffle Flower Crafts. Today I'm going to use the In Every Way stamp set. I've already got my stamp on the block. I've used Don't Forget to Be Awesome and Today. So let me show you what we're going to do with that. I just cut a piece of watercolor paper and we're going to stamp on this using Versamark. And then we're going to heat emboss it with white embossing powder to start with. We're going to do kind of a faux watercolor technique that I have been having fun with. It's kind of an emboss resist as well. So if you like those, I think you'll like this one too. This is just white embossing powder. Okay, and we'll heat set it with my heat gun. Okay, now we're going to start with our resist part, and I'm just using a few stamp pads from Stampin' Up! Some nice, bright, springy colors. And we're going to use these little sponge applicators to put the color on. I'm going to start with the darker color, the coral. And just do it in a circular motion. Go for some yellow. Oops, got away. Okay, so there's still color. Mix this up and get them out of the way. And now I'm just going to clean it up with a plain old paper towel. I'm just going to rub over the embossed words. And that'll take the ink off of them. Make them really shine. If you need to, you can always hop on it. Um, if it's really hard to get off, this seems to be fine though. Dry. Okay. So now we're going to do the fake watercolor part. Um, we're actually using water in a paintbrush, and instead of painting over it, we're just going to flick water spots over the part we just painted. So I'm just going to kind of tap it around, and the water is going to collect the ink into little pools and you can kind of see if you want to you can take that paper towel and just dab a corner into some of the water and then set it down and do it. It'll suck the ink out of it and leave a little white spot. It's kind of fun to watch. You could just leave it dry too. But I'm always so impatient. <laughs> so that gives it the watercolor look. want to you can always add more 
like it though. Okay. So there's kind of a deep watercolor look. Ooh. All right, I'm just going to finish this card now. I already have a yellow card base all cut. I'm just going to set down on the front. And I have these fun sparkly they're flowers from Paper Sweeties. Thought maybe we'd throw a couple of them on here. of the clear on their color. Okay. So just gluing those down with a little liquid adhesive and let it dry. I'm going to add some twine to the top. And pretty quick card really, right? This is just a coral twine. Turn the ends off. I think I'll move it over here. There's my finished card. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks for joining me for another Watch It Wednesday. Thanks, bye.